hello guys in this part we are going to learn about how to hide and show an info window in Google map programmatically so here in this example here by using this fragment I display the Google map I display Google map on this fragment this is the fragment layout and on that fragment I use this fragment for displaying the Google map with IT map IT so now I have to I am at a button here so whenever user click the button by using this button we can hide and show the info window so here I add a button now specify the layout and draw it and draw it layout and draw it layout height set the height as wrap content now specify the width and draw it layout width is match parent specify it as uh, match parent this match parent okay now provide and draw it and draw it id provide an id for the button android id plus id i give it as i give it as map bn map bn is an ID for the button okay now provide a text for the button and row it text and row it text and row text equal to show or height show or height show or height in four window in four window okay now align this button below that fragment so and draw it layout below and draw it layout below using the ID of that particular fragment here it is map ID so plus ID and here it is map ID okay now save it now at the graphical layout you can see that here we got a button below that particular fragment okay save it now here is the class map here is the fragment class corresponding to that fragment layout so here we need a button object so add a button object button bn now we need to add the appropriate packages for the button so import the packages for the button also we need an object of marker and marker options here so first create an object of marker marker we need this marker object for hiding and showing that info window programmatically also we need an object of marker options here I name it as marker options marker options okay save it now we need to create that marker and add it into Google map so using that marker options object marker options equal to marker options is equal to new marker options dot add the position dot position here the position is highly part now specify title and snippet which are the title and snippet is used to create the info window so add a title high part and now add a snippet snippet and provide a text on the snippet this is my place this is my place provide a semicolon here now save it now we have to add these marker options into Google map also we need an object of marker so marker equal to marker equal to Google map dot add marker and provide that marker options object save it uh, now and uh, now we need we need to zoom camera into that particular place so by using the Google map object Google map and Google map dot move camera using the camera update factory camera camera update factory object 
camera update factory dot new lag energy zoom provide that place and zoom level semicolon and save it okay now we add the marker into google map okay now we have to initialize the button the button is placed inside a fragment so we need the view class object for initializing the button so bn bn equal to v dot v dot find view by id find view by id r dot id dot that button object here it is that particular button object is map id here is the map id it is the id for the button and provide that id <laughs> map id and cast the button cast it into button object provide a casting here button button okay now make the action listeners for the button so bn dot set on click listener set on click listener new view dot new view dot on click listener okay here is a semicolon needed and here we need to add some packages import the on click listener packages okay now save it delete this okay and now we need to hide and show the info window so we need a boolean variable here boolean status I create a boolean variable for checking the status of the info window I initialize it with it with true and on the button click option here I check if if status is true if status is true now I have to make the info window visible so using the marker option marker object we have to make the info window visible so marker dot there is a method called show info window this will this will make the info window visible now change the text of the button set text bn dot set text uh, set text now the mark info window is visible so change the set text as height 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 uh, info window height info window okay also change the status in the false also change the value of that boolean variable status into false one okay now on else if if else that means now the marker is visible so marker dot using the marker object we now hide the info window so using a method called hide info window by using this method we can hide the info window programmatically now change the text of the button set text into show info window into show info window show info window okay uh, now change the status into value of stat status into true okay now we complete the coding now we have to check the project on a real device so run it and copy the apk file and run it on a real device